Hello guys and welcome back to the Definitive Edition campaign series. The Lord of Greece is what we're currently at and we're about to jump into the second one called Acropolis. Now a lot of you made fun of my pronunciation last time. I don't appreciate that. But I will carry on. And yeah, we'll let, the, we'll let this one play off. Your people are now largely settled and they have prospered for the past several generations. You are not alone, however. Other city-states have risen and begun to expand as well. As border clashes begin, it becomes clear that growth is possible only at the expense of neighboring rivals. The Tyrrhenians covet the lands that you now control and have begun to aggressively press the issue. This outrage must not be allowed to continue. Secure your control over this region by capturing the ancient ruins close to the nearby town of Tyrins. Build two sentry towers adjacent to the ruins to deter any further enemy incursions. Alright, so our objectives this time is capture the ruins and construct two sentry towers beside the ruins. Now, let me just quickly check if the, the history... Your people no, it is different for each. Alright. So some of you asked me to uh, just like scroll slowly through the history, so those who want to read it can read it. I'll do that now, so um, please pause the video where you find fit if you want to read everything that is in the history. I know I didn't do that for the first video, but hopefully you guys will still be okay. So hints say, utilize your initial stone reserves wisely. Stone will prove useful in several situations. Seize and defend as many stone and gold mines as you can, for they are the key to victory. The Mycenaeans are restricted to the Bronze Age. You cannot advance to the Iron Age. Gotcha. People are now the Mediterranean so we've jumped 200 are years now... uh, forward in time before Common Era. So yeah, we still have Hardest selected. Now uh, I'm not sure if that's the best decision, but... Uh... YOLO! Let's go. Oh shit! Here we go. Okay. Wait, I had m many houses. I didn't need to make a house. So yeah, I did turn up the volume for the... Um... Oh no! Shit. But we're just gonna assume that it's okay. I'll speak loudly, just in case. Why do they place the mill, I mean the granary there? Like, they could have just placed it right next to it, couldn't they? So we're supposed to place two sentry towers there. Okay, there we go. Create two sentry tower in the marked area. Capture ruins. Gotcha. We are restricted to... Was it the Bronze Age? Yes. We'll make a uh, storage pit over here. Let's get our eco rolling. I guess I'm gonna do some upgrades here just in case we get attacked. Oh no. Again, that's the, this is like just like AW2 where they place inefficient, inefficient resource gathering buildings just for the sake of it. Okay, I realized I didn't put enough guys on food, so we're now gonna have idle time. Great. Oh well. Happens. Actually, you know what? Let's cancel that so we can make more bills first. I'm gonna do a dock and just build the economy. I'm I'm not sure if I'll, I'm there in third age. That is scary. We have a market already. So we can do some economy upgrades. If we wish to do that. Probably. You know what? Nah. Uh, wait. Can we not get over there? Oh shit! Okay, it's just a. Oh god. Oh, I should have upgraded them. Oh no. Uh, watchtower. Oh shit. Uh, 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 uh. Oh. Uh, don't attack me. Don't attack me. Don't attack me. Alright, so I'm, I'm planning to upgrade walls now as well. Please build that tower fast. Oh no! Okay. <laughs> well, that was a fast game. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you next time. Oh, I'm gonna restart. <laughs> God damn it. Alright. Alright, lesson learned. Uh, walls. 
Yes. Also, I'm gonna upgrade the military right away. Uh, I'll make a storage pit down here instead. I'm gonna just wall ourselves in because else we're gonna die. That was good to know. Uh, guys! Thank you. Um. Yeah, I'll make a dock first as well. But we'll try to wall in. Wall certain areas in at least. I wanna make a dock. Get, ah, I removed that fish by making that there. Feels bad. Right, so. No, that's not the villager. So we cannot go out here and hunt this because the guys will come and wreck us. So the plan is, I suppose, just to. I should have. Actually, I may really need to upgrade those guys. This is the plan. Hopefully, we'll be in time. We can make farms if we need that. We'll, we'll probably have to. How fast do we build these? Hopefully, this will be in time. From here. And then this is the last part. I guess that's why they say the stone will be useful at the starting ages. I'm gonna move out with these guys though, I don't want to keep them inside our base. Hope we finish our walls in time. Oh! No! Oh shit! Oh shit! Is this another? Oh. All right. Lesson learned. First thing we do: upgrade small walls. All right. Lesson learned. Third try. No problems, guys. We got this. We don't need no deer. We just need walls. All right, don't worry, guys. I I I got this under control now. Still gonna send these guys out because I don't feel like we need them behind our walls. Don't worry, guys. I know what I'm doing. Try to sneak like along the edge here so we don't actually run. I want to avoid those units if I can, and maybe go and do some economy damage instead. Now, wouldn't that be sweet? All right, we should be walled now, right? Until the transport unit's in, at least. Just check our wall. Oh, seems like we are walled. If uh, pathing is anything to trust. So yeah, onwards. You know what? I'm gonna upgrade tower as well. I think just to make a tower behind each wall. They only have 200 HP. Well, it should be 200 uh, strikes to actually break it down. But still, I'm, I'm always paranoid with these things when I don't know the game properly. Wait, is there not passage over there? We have to go through water. Oh, they are running. That seems like there are units there then. Might have to make uh, a few units here. Uh, water units, that is. Oh no! Oh, scary. Okay, we can walk across. Oh. Get him. I'll let one guy chase him. The other guys can go scout. Alright, so that seems to be helpful. Oh, power. We want to avoid that. Okay, I'm feeling safe for now. That's at least for certain. I'm just gonna run past, see uh, what they have really. Don't really care about these two clubmen. Uh, make one more, two more fishing boats. Then we'll try to mix in some uh, actual units. Uh, ships, rather. Where does they don't attack the walls, even? By the way, when I pronounced Pericles, 
I know it's... I know it's Pericles, okay? Relax. But where I am from, we pronounce all the names like... with S at the end. So, I apologize. Sorry. Please forgive me for mispronouncing the Greek nicknames. It's the elephant, so come here. Maybe I should upgrade these now. I mean, maybe they don't have army around this. I mean, I'm already in the target. Oh, they have army. Never mind that. But I want to make a scout ship. Oh, I got moused. Well, that was fine. I was going to go up anyway, although we don't have resources, so never mind. Just a pleb. Making excuses. Okay, can we debate? Yep. We lure them over there while this guy keeps scouting. Oh, there's another tower. I wonder if you could just cheese this mission and transport villagers over there and just run to make a tower. Capture ruins. Oh, I didn't do that. But I need to do that as well, so I guess you can't. Yeah, so we'll use this scout ship now to uh, explore a little bit and then we'll... Uh, Take it from there, I guess. We do actually have one deer inside. Or gazelle. Oh, I should have done these. But I'm just gonna go up and I'm gonna do a uh, wheelbarrow. That's uh, like the most important economy upgrade, I think, because villagers move so much faster after that is done. Alright, what is this? Seems like a lot of resources on this cliff here. Yeah, we'll make a transport ship. Light transport ship. Get over there. I have two. I don't have two fuel age buildings. I won't actually be able to click up. Uh, let me just check my tech tree here quickly. Academy units move faster and cost less. Ships move 20%. Oh, ships move 20% faster. Okay, that helps. I'm just gonna check our tech tree for stable and archer range. So. We don't get chariot archers apparently. We get cavalry though, so I guess we're gonna go up with a stable as our second building. We'll make a stable here. Oh, this can be crossed though, it seems. Alright, we'll make a light transport ship regardless, as soon as we can. Keep scouting. There we go, can click up now. Now I'm gonna do this. Um, Woodworking. Extra missile range. I assume that's for ships as well. I don't know for sure though, but I'm assuming. We'll see though when it finishes. And I mean, I don't have any gold inside my base, right? So we're gonna. I'm sure there's gonna be gold here. We shall travel across and find out. How much is it? 150 wood. Okay. We, got, we have a lot of uh, food income now from uh, from the docks and the fishing ships. Actually, I've played like a, I have a few hours now in multiplayer in DE, but I've never really played with water units besides the scouting ship. So I don't really know how the water mechanics work exactly, nor what units counter which on water. So we shall see. We shall see. I'm sure I'll have to play with more water units as the as the game goes on. Domestication. I should do that, but I think I'm gonna save resources for now and do a wheelbarrow first. I think it's called wheelbarrow here as well. I'm not too sure though. Okay, let's see how this uh, transport ship works. We'll send like. Oh, it can have five people inside. So we'll send. Oh no. Okay, there's three. And these two guys as well. All right, and unload there. So exactly the same as uh, as the HMPS2 in that regard. I'm gonna make some cavalry. Oh yeah, and then wheel. It's called wheel, not wheelbarrow. Now I'm, I'm hoping that, you know what? I'm gonna wall this. We don't want any unpleasant surprises. Okay, there's no gold here. I'm gonna make a government center here. Because why the hell not? So I can make more town centers. So where do we travel to get gold then is the next question. Um, I guess we don't get gold. 
This is stone, right? Yep. Still don't see any gold on the minimap either. Guess we'll find out eventually, but... Right, so let's make a TC here. As we look for some more gold. I'm not sure how much units the enemies make, but I'm gonna dare take a little bit of risk here and open up one of the walls now and run outside with these cavalry. Oh. Yeah, our castle units are far superior. We can't really do more upgrades though. Let me check what the nobility upgrade costs. Because it's an upgrade that gives extra HP to our cavalry. 120 gold, okay. Wait, for all horse units, yeah. We can't afford that because we ain't got no gold. But if my suspicion is correct, I'm expecting the AI to not be making too much uh, military past what they started with. There's not too much stone here, but... We'll deal with it. And I assume the... From what I was read from the comment section, every original campaign has 75 pop limit. I'm not sure if that's correct or not, but... I mean, I'm, I don't see why you would lie to me about that, so... Uh, I reckon there won't be too many big fights and large-scale battles. That stuff. I guess you can already tell how much faster the villagers are moving now compared to when we... Compared to before. Oh, there's gold. Okay, okay. So we're gonna have to ex uh, travel out there. Let's see what upgrades we have here now. Upgrade to merchant ship. That's a trade boat. Upgrade to fishing ship. We should say what exactly it does as well, but I'll do that. See what happens. Okay, I'm gonna send... I'm gonna take five guys. Five guys. Five guys, and we're gonna go and try and take that gold. We'll transport out, because I don't, still don't feel safe about opening my walls. Rather safe than sorry, as they say. Okay, we'll unload here. I'll just help use the villager to help villagers to help. You know what? Screw that. Open up. Make another town center there. And I'm just gonna bring these guys as well. Attack the tower. Should have plenty of economy going here anyway, so there we go. Just attack that, because I don't see any military from them, so I don't see why not just attack. Yeah, that goes down fast enough, so... Wait, do we have 50? Oh, did we have 50? Oh, we have 50 pop cap on this game. Didn't realize. Okay, you know what I'm also going to do? I'm going to do some towers here. Medium wall. Don't want that. Now they're efficient ships. They look better. They look bigger. I assume they work faster. Efficient ship has more hit points and is faster than the ship fishing boat. Okay. So it doesn't... Oh! I'm going to make scouts. Because I've... this guy's going to wreck us up. So it doesn't have... It doesn't have... Gather faster. Like, just the exact... The actual gathering. It just... Uh moves faster and has more HP. We can appreciate that. He's actually not attacking, he's just scouting. Seems like this mission as well, I'm, I'm probably overcomplicating things. I'm also making too many town centers given in mind that we have a uh, 50... Oh, where am I getting attacked? When you think about the fact that we have 50 HP, uh, not 50 HP, 50 population only. I'm, pr I'm waking, wait, making way too much eco. Yeah, we'll take out this storage pit and then we're gonna run and see if we can just move up here. Oh, oh, they actually have some forces here, but they're still just feudal age units. They are in the third age. But I've only seen. Uh, I keep saying feudal age. I've only seen second age um, military from them. So I guess it's time to get rid of some bills. Sorry, guys. Ay, ay, ay. Sorry, apologies. We'll add the stables here and here. And run forward. Where's the transport ship we had? From here, I'm gonna bring wheels over across here. Oh!
Oh boy. They're making more units than I, than I anticipated. I'm gonna make some towers to help us uh, hold this area. Let's fight here in the range of the towers. Yeah, but still, there's only a few less units. Mm. This is quite awesome that we can stack villagers. It's helpful to fight these guys. Um, I kind of don't want to fight though with the bills because they die pretty damn fast. Oh, they started attacking. Oh, they actually the AI is actually starting to do things. Go on there. Come on, guys, get to work. Kill them. They're still only making the. Um, Okay, wait, uh, 175. Okay, we need more gold for that. They're still only making uh, few, not few age, two age units though. So these cavalry should be enough to deal with that for now. Let's do the um, gold mining upgrade. There we go. Should have done more of the eco upgrades because we are st we are we have so many extra resources. I'm just gonna make. We have so much stone. They're actually pumping up a lot of units. Sneak a stable up there as well. Before we scout the area. Keep sending in stuff as well. Uh, did I do nobility? Nope, we're doing that now. Yeah, this they, it feels as long as they keep making these units, I don't think we're, they're gonna break this army. We barely take damage. One damage per hit. So that's promising for us. Oh, more stone. Just gonna run past here. I have a feeling that with wheel, when the villagers run so fast, we could cheese this mission and run straight up here to build a tower. Right there and there. I yeah, only had stone. Oh! <gasps> Just tell me there's more st Oh, there's stone, okay. That got me a little bit worried, not gonna lie. But, wait, we could just delete... Oh, we built all the towers here. Alright, that's fine. I don't see too much stone. There's probably going to be stone around the map, though. So, fear not. He's repairing, bastard. Oh, they have transport as well. Oh, there's the ruins. Oh, we could complete completed that now. Want to get out of reach? Ah, he still reaches the further, furthest one. Okay, whatever. So now it's just about the towers here. So we just need the resources. We should have the resources now for a second. But where was I supposed to build again? Wasn't it up here? Oh yeah, on that flag and that flag. Gotcha. All right. I think we can just go there and build now, and we should be fine. We can even bring these bills. Because it seems like not a big problem right now. The tower is busy with this guy. So I think these will go up. And I think we should win the mission then. I think we played it right though. I mean... Barred two restarts because of the messed up beginning, but still. They have a lot of second age units though. Wait, what? These are not sentry towers. Those will be sentry towers. Shall finish the wall off for you guys. You're welcome. Right, as soon as this upgrade finishes, we should be victorious. Here we go. It's quite the... Uh... <laughs> It's not like AOE 2 where we get like oh Tyridian troops flee before the blades of your disciplined soldiers. With the ruins and mineral resources of the region secured, the conflict will surely not last much longer. Soon your enemies will humbly kneel before you, offering their wealth and begging for peace. With the nearby region secured, your people can now look beyond their borders. 
making alliances and even expanding overseas, lead them onward. Onward. Roger that. So yeah, lessons from this one. Since we have 50 population cap, we may, we're making way too much economy. Uh, also, walling seems to be crucial, at least at, at first, when we're playing on hardest. Um, and yeah, the AI is acting a little bit weird. I'm not sure. No. Okay, so like, the question is... Wait, now we've gone back in time. That's fine. But, um... But, yeah. They kept making second age units only there, even though they are they were in the third age. Not so sure if that's how it's meant to be, but even I guess if they made third age units, we would have been in a big pickle. So, I'm not complaining. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed Acropolis. And I will see you next time for the conquest of, conquest of Crete.